All right, what we got here is the Slim Minimalist Front Pocket RFID Blocking Leather Wallet for Men or Women. So I just got it here, and this is it. And, okay, don't put this bag over children. Got it. And it just comes like this, and it's pretty small, okay? But it's supposed to be able to hold a lot of stuff. So this is the wallet I have now. You can kind of see the difference. And we're gonna see if this can fit in here. I got a few cards, um, a bit of cash, uh, driver's license is in there and a few other things. See how much of that can fit in here and if this can actually be a replacement for the wallet I have. So let's just pause this. Okay, I took it out of the package and you can kind of see there's compartments on both sides. This is to make it easier to flip cards up. Okay. Let's see what I can do with this. Okay, and then here's what I'm going to try to fit in to this wallet. Uh, some cash, business cards. I have these cards I have to carry with me. I have um, 2R for business. And that's my license, and these are like store cards and like an insurance card. So let's see what happens. Okay, this is it. I got everything in here. And it is less, quite a bit less bulky than the other wallets. You got the cash in there, fold it in half. That's my ID, I just turned it around so you can't see what that is. This is the... Uh, main credit card I use my PayPal one and my bank one and then I have this one here as the two business ones that's my other debit card and these were the um, store cards like the rewards cards and then that health information so I think it did a pretty good job here I mean like to say you could get that in your front pocket I mean even in your back pocket that's gonna save some space and the money's kind of sticking out here I guess it goes back in a little bit it's not bad we make it work out a little bit as I wear it and use it it'll probably loosen up a bit so I'm gonna try this a few days and uh, let you know how it how it works out but uh, it's pretty interesting it's all it all fits in there I mean that's almost the same size as this wallet I mean this is empty now it's like the same size has this wallet with nothing in it, right? Look at that, it's even smaller, really. Well, about the same. So, all right, I'll get my re review back here in a couple days. All right, guys, it's been a week, and I've been, actually over a week, and I've been using this wallet, and gotta tell you, a winner I like it okay um, this is my license normally I have it turned around but easy to slide out uh, these cards are easy to get out you can even do it in one hand right and so I got like five cards in there plus two store cards these rewards cards plus two uh, like health insurance cards uh, business cards are in there and cash is in there even got the cash to fit in a little better than the first video. And I gotta tell you, really no no complaints. The only possible complaint is that, you know, your cash is folded in half right here. And with the other wallet, which is right here, you know, I, I used to be able to reach in there, pull, pull out, you know, find the bills I need and pull them out. Where with this one, you have to pull the whole wad out and then count it. So that's the only negative. But, you know, honestly, with, you know, I haven't used that much cash because I'm using uh, these cards a lot. I mean, who, who doesn't, who really uses cash anymore, you know, if it's using these cards. And with the PayPal one, I'll just throw a little plug in there that I get 1% cash back and it comes out of my checking, which I wrote about that in the article, which should be linked below. So you can find that at theoriginalsource.com. And... 
Um, so, you know, I get 1% on that. A couple of other, other advantages with that card. So, overall, I mean, I give this a 4 out of 5. I mean, a 5 out of 5. <laughs> Definitely. Um, okay, we'll call it a 4.5 out of 5. Uh, or 5. Because, I mean, it's... I can fit in either pocket. It's a lot thinner. There's just a whole lot less bulk. I mean, I plan on using this for years to come. So, highly recommend it. Go get yourself one. That's it. See you later.